okay guys so in this video i'm going to show you how to set up uh, your mixing board to allow a sound board so you can actually play effects like effects like where's the last yes. sauce so while you're speaking you can have effects going let me just do I'm it just damn, adjusting son, the volume here Fatality. Yep. Damn, so son. while Where's you're doing a podcast, sauce? you can use that. So right now I'm using this channel here, which is three and four. I have two phonos. What do you call these? They're not phonos. The audio jack. Yeah, audio jacks. So that is in this channel being controlled by this volume here, and then in this channel I have my secondary mic for my co-host tones. Oh, okay, one minute. Oh, I didn't catch you. I've I had your volume down. Hello, it's your boy Tony. Yes, so that's that mic over there, which is going out of here and it's plugged in just there. This is my mic, so you can see as I raise that there, my volume will get higher or lower. So that is a simple setup of the Behringer 802 USB. This on the other side of this is actually a tablet, which I can go back and show you. So right there i've got a simple app which is a, a soundboard app and just when i lose control <laughs> and you find john carter just do it when the volume's a bit low so make that a bit higher fatality so you just basically select it and it's plugged into the headphone jack which then this goes over here plugged into there that's a quick look at the Behringer and how to set up set up why is that Target. oh quick change the channel volume's gone down so make the volume higher. quick get to the chopper okay so you can have all sorts of where's the lamb so damn son where So that's a look at the Behringer and quick overview of how to set that up. The Behringer is plugged into the PC via USB. So there's a USB in the back and a power and my mic needs phantom power so phantom power is on. Any other mics that don't your stock is either on or off. You can't turn it off individual channels. 